Good evening. Welcome to ORP TV. I'm Craig Stegner. Come to you from the JK Auto Repair Studio. JK Auto Repair is a full service car care provider located at 2301 West Selmore Road in Ozark, Missouri. Go over and talk to John and Zach and Lance. I tell you what, they'll treat you like family. Let them uh, treat you like family. Great people over there. 5812004. This is the All Parts Auto Salvage. Midweek show, All Parts Auto Salvage with two locations in Springfield. 2600 North Benton is the Salvage Yard. 425 East Kearney is the parts store. All Parts Auto Salvage, as well as JK, have both done work on every vehicle I've ever had, and I couldn't recommend them highly enough. All Parts Auto Salvage with the two locations. 425 East Kearney is a parts store. Walk right in. They've got some parts pre-pulled. But anything you need, they can get for you through their network of salvage yard connections. Let us help you fix your car. I want to thank our sponsors, of course, JK Auto Repair, All Parts Auto Salvage, Hillbilly Speedway in Fairgrove, Hodges Tree Trimming, Finkbinder Transfer and Storage, Home Sweet Home Realty and Renee Frizzell, Rochelle Summers Toys for Tots, Appleton Imaging, Sigs and Swigs, DTA Bear Paws and Gloves, Twister Alley Raceway, the Missouri Motocross Hall of Fame, ICWF, Independent Circuit Wrestling Federation, and Top Rope Television. Well, this is what we've got to talk about this week. We're getting down towards the end of all the seasons, so what we've got is uh, less and less events. We're kind of in that area in between uh, wrapping up these seasons and starting our wintertime ones. The uh, Super Pro Supercross, the uh, Mid-South Arena Cross, uh, Hoosier Arena Cross, all of that. So we're kind of running down towards the end of the season. But here's what we've got. We've got a few special events to tell you about. North Central Arkansas Speedway. This is a track that's reached out to us and asked us if we would talk about them. And of course, we're glad to. So I want to tell you, this Saturday night, this says October 16th, it was postponed because of rain. It's postponed to this Saturday. We're going to talk about that later during the Appleton Imaging forecast. And hopefully... It's going to go better this weekend. Not looking great, but this is the Fan Appreciation Night in Yellville, Arkansas. Um, going to have uh, favorite drivers being met, so they're going to do a special event in intermission for the fans. Lightning rods, hobby stocks, power ice, super stocks, B mods, $1,000 to win. Great event if you're down in Southern Outlaw Late Model Series down towards Yellville. Any of these tracks that we talk about, tell them. Tell them you heard. If you talk to one of their officials, tell them you heard about them here on ORP TV. We want, they probably already know, hopefully, but if they don't, they need to know for sure. They can never know too much, by the way. This weekend at Nevada, this is an event that's uh, the Thursday through Saturday, a special three day event. Thursday is going to be practice, Friday and Saturday will be the full show, the Titans Clash. Uh, big event. The Titans B-Mod Series, they've got their sponsors on here. This is a big event in Nevada. Uh, that's going to be going on this weekend. Lucas Oil Speedway has wrapped up. Uh, hey, Tony, don't you go nowhere. We're going to be talking to your name's going to come up here in just a little bit. Lucas Oil Speedway has a special event this weekend. This is the Monster Trucks. Uh, racing is done there. But if you have never seen from uh, Republic, Missouri, the... I don't know, what is it, 100,000 horsepower or something insane, shockwave, jet truck, you want to see that. That's coming up Saturday night, the Monster Truck Show, Eva Destruction. Springfield Raceway has their Cash Money Late Model Series. Uh, you can see they're doing their uh, breast cancer awareness campaign, Saturday, October 23rd. Uh, this is a big event with the Cash Money Late Models always, $1,200 to win, $450 to start. Uh, great event there that uh, starts it looks like at uh, 5 30 so Springfield Raceway there Tri-State Speedway my buddy Rob Nugent this is the Spooker this is their big event this is the 42nd uh, annual Spooker honoring John Stand uh, it starts Wednesday night with their test and tune then Thursday Friday Saturday ton of sponsors there at Pecola Oklahoma great event uh so that's a big one going on we have uh before we get to that 
Titans Clash, like I said, at Nevada. Got weekly racing at I-35. Sunday Fun Day at Kansas Raceway. World of Outlaws at Lakeside. Uh, let's see, what did we not hit here? Uh, Mocan has the CDRA Bracket Finals. This is team racing. So uh, all the area drag strips are going to be sending their bracket racers, uh, their teams, to Mocan. Always a lot of fun. Three-day event there. Uh, Friday, Saturday, Sunday uh, at Mocan. NASCAR. Here's where we are in the season. We are down to just a couple races left after last week's win. Kyle Larson is locked in. He's going to uh, already be assured a spot in the championship running. Ryan Blaney makes a huge jump up to the second place. Denny Hamlin, uh, after cussing everybody out, he's up to third. Kyle Busch, da da, da da, here he comes. Couple races left. Kyle Busch getting hot at a good time. If you're a Busch fan, Chase Elliott makes is right there below the line, but still in it. Keselowski, Truex Jr., and Joey Logano. Uh, those four are just outside, but on the bubble. Xfinity, Xfinity, AJ Allmendinger, Austin Cindric, Justin Allgaier, and Noah Gragson are your top four. Uh, Daniel Hemrick, Justin Haley, Harrison Burton, and Brandon Jones round out your top eight. Over in the truck series, John Hunter Nemechek. You see, there's a lot of second generation racers, some of them third. Got the Nemechek, uh, what do we have here? Uh, Harrison Burton. Um, I don't know about this. They probably had some racing in there, but a lot of second and third generation. Kyle Busch may win a championship here with his driver, John Hunter Nemechek, Ben Rhodes, Matt Crafton, defending champion Sheldon Reed, Stuart Friesen, Chandler Smith, who also races for Kyle Busch and raced here at Lebanon last year in the ARCA Series, Carson Hosever, and Zane Smith are your top eight in the Truck Series. NHRA has two events left. Steve Torrance doesn't qualify first, but he wins all the time. He's in your lead. Brittany Force has only won, I think, once this year, but she qualifies the best. So she's in second. Pretty big drop off after that. Uh, Justin Ashley, Mike Salinas, and Billy Torrance. These guys all have wins. All five of them have wins in this series. That's the top fuel. Funny car, all with wins. Down here, John Force and Cruz Pedregon uh, tied for fourth. J.R. Todd, it cannot possibly, I guess one point, it could get one point closer because right now, let's see there, there's what you got. Matt Hagen is one point out of first place. That could be a qualifying, that could be anything. I mean, the every single pass is going to count for this one for the championship. Ryan, uh, Ron Caps and Matt Hagen. Of course, we talked about earlier in the week, Matt Hagen going to go over to the new Tony Stewart drag racing team. Pro Stock, Greg Anderson uh, out front of Erica Enders looking for her fifth championship. Greg Anderson just won his record-setting 98th win. Uh, Dallas Glenn, Kyle Koretsky, and Aaron Stanfield uh, significantly out of the hunt for the championship, but still top five. And Motorcycle, Matt Smith, Angel Sampay, who won last week, she closed that gap quite a bit. Steve Johnson, Eddie Krywick, and Scotty Polachek uh, round out your top five there. Uh, top three could be close again, just two races left in the NHRA. Like I said, not a lot to talk about from this last weekend, but uh, moving forward. Here we go. Birthdays brought to you by Hodges Tree Trimming. Hodges Tree Trimming, we guarantee the best work at the best price. Whether you have pruning, trimming, tree removal, planting, consultation, brush removing, stump grinding, free estimates from Chris Hodges, Franklin Hodges, and Charles Nix. Give them a call. Tell them, of course, you heard about them here on ORP TV. Hodges Tree Trimming, again, the best work at the best price. Birthdays today, Wesley Men's House, Shelly Lee from 417 Motorsports, Blake Hughes. This little girl, I've known her since she was... Uh, what do they say? Knee high to a grasshopper. Lindsay Phoenix, absolutely outstanding woman. Uh, happy birthday to all of them. 
Tomorrow, Rusty Skaggs, Justin Lawson, Ashley Pierce Merriweather, James Davis, Michael Mitchell, Crystal Diebold, and Carl Myers all tomorrow. Friday, Ruth Bricky and the lovely Shelby Rose. Shelby, I hope you have a great birthday on Friday. Saturday, there it is. Tennessee Tony Bricado with a birthday coming up on Saturday. Truck driver, his daughter Kinsey is one of the coolest, fastest racers from Mississippi. I uh, love that family. Tony Bricado, man, when you're up this way again, you got to come see us. I'm going to take you. We're going we're gonna to buy you a beer for your birthday for sure. Vince Throckmorton, legendary uh, enduro rider and hair scramble racer from around here. And Kelly Gates, uh, the one who started the Midwest 660 race series, all with birthdays on Saturday. Sunday, from All Parts Auto Salvage, just uh, one of the sweetest girls you'll ever meet, Krista Holsted with a birthday, Adam Curl, Mike Higby, and uh, a girl that used to work at Ozark Fitness, now she's a published romance novelist. Happy birthday to you, Jennifer Spurgeon. On Monday, Cliff Taylor, Josh Golubsky, Devin Stone, and Cameron Wheat. Tuesday, the man, Marty Chance. Uh, if you, uh, Neil Chance Racing Converters, this is uh, Neil was Marty's dad. Marty runs this place. Absolutely great guy. Happy birthday coming up. Shane Lakey with a birthday on Tuesday, as well as Brian Creason. And I did not miss it. James Smith, uh, Heather, and Chip Abramovitz's son in law, who I was lucky enough to perform their wedding, and he was lucky enough to marry Courtney. He had a birthday yesterday, so happy birthday late. Happy birthday to you, James. Hope it was a great one. Again, All Parts Auto Salvage with two locations in Springfield. 425 East Kearney's this great looking store. If you're old like me, you know that this used to be the uh, day old bread store, but now it's All Parts Auto Salvage and you can see they've got parts pre-pooled and they walk right in, take care of, uh, let Krista take care of you and uh, tell her ha early happy birthday too. Appleton Imaging, all service photography, Missy and David Appleton, great people. David's a phenomenal photographer and Missy does an outstanding job at performing weddings. If you need something done, 417-234-4992. Tomorrow, so we had some racing going on tonight. Uh, where was that at? Tri-State had their TNT. Tomorrow they start racing, gonna be cool, but cool weather means fast cars. Tomorrow, Friday, even a little warmer, nicer. And then Saturday, Sunday, let's just keep our fingers crossed that that rain is way late in the night, barely even on considered Saturday, like 11.59 on Saturday night and knock off at 12.05 on Sunday morning, just a little bit of rain so we can get our racing in. Appleton Imaging, all service target fee, 2344992. This is your All Parts Auto Salvage Race Weekend lineup. Circle Tracks, I 35 Speedway in Winston. Uh, that is Saturday night. They have their weekly racing. Kansas City Raceway uh, in Kansas City, or uh, Independence, Missouri. Sunday Fun Day Racing, so kind of a test and tune. Lakeside Speedway, Friday night. That is the World of Outlaws event. Lucas Oil Speedway, of course we said that was the Outlaw Monster Trucks with Shockwave there. Monette Raceway has their weekly racing on Saturday night. Nevada, a Thursday, Friday event. This is the Titans Clash as we talked about. Uh, of course they are doing their test and tune uh, tonight. North Central Arkansas Speedway racing Saturday. Randolph County Raceway, this event was postponed Last week, uh, that is coming up Friday night, Springfield Raceway Saturday with the Cash Money Late Models, Tri-State Speedway with a long four-day event. Again, this is the 42nd Annual Spooker honoring John Stand. Valley Speedway, uh, Saturday night. This is the King of K Kansas City Star, their newspaper, the King of Kansas City Star Mod Light Fall Brawl. Sounds like a lot of fun. So that one's going on at Valley Speedway. Kind of a late edition here. That's why it's not up here in the correct spot alphabetically. Lebanon Midway Speedway with racing going on uh, Friday night. 
Drag strips. Bonterre has bracket racing going on on Saturday. Don't know who's going to be bracket racing because I think they'd send their team to Mocan. But Memphis International Raceway has something called the IRRA Championship. i got to be honest, I didn't look that up yet. Don't know what it is, but something drag race. Mocan, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, the CDRA Bracket Championship. Great event, all the teams. Usually they give out awards for best uh, pits, uh, best uh, food, best uh, team uniforms, all kinds of stuff. Everybody makes food a lot of fun. Uh, usually they do some kind of trick-or-treating there too, so for the kids that's a lot of fun. Tulsa Raceway Park has a Test and Tune Friday and Saturday, Gambler's Race Saturday, and Midnight Drag Saturday night. On the pro scene, just NASCAR, no NHRA this weekend. Saturday events, all Kansas Speedway, 2 o'clock on NBC is Xfinity. MAV TV Saturday night for the ARCA race. NBC Sports Network for NASCAR at 2 o'clock. The reason this is on NBC and this is on NBC Sports Network, mark my words, they're getting you used to having that on uh, behind a paywall. They've already talked about it. Expect next year or maybe the next, you'll be paying five, ten dollars a month to watch the Premier Cup racing. So go ahead and cuss and kick stuff over now. It's going to happen though. So there you have it. That's going to do it. Let's uh, try pausing this here for just a second. Uh, that's going to do it. We do have a new page that we just set up today, Stagner Media. The reason I did that, that's on the page here listed. Uh, we just did that as kind of a resume page. Uh, if you're curious, it's going to have some of the logos we've done, some of the artwork we've done for some of the teams, some of the interviews, weddings I've performed, the ICWF, Independent Circuit Wrestling Federation work. Uh, just kind of putting it all out there, what all we can do, because we're trying to make some of that money, because i got this new studio to pay for. But we, whatever it is you need, if you're looking for some place to sponsor and a guy who will just sing and dance and uh, beg for uh, customers to come into your place, I'm your man. See you back here Sunday with all the results from these races and hopefully a whole lot of other cool stories on ORP TV Live, 6 o'clock on Facebook. Until then, I'm Stag. We'll see you then.